The Central Province Premier Football League's Hardware House Agorobe Cup was marred by spectator violence on Sunday after supporters from Goilala invaded the field and started attacking players from the Koyari team. Despite the abrupt end to proceedings in the grand final at the Mari Barracks Oval, the game proved entertaining and kept everyone on their feet. Koilala were arguably a tough opponent for Koyari and Koyari were not to be put down easily. The match was promising with strong running by forwards from both teams. The tackles were also impressive. Goilala missed out in a try with an offside ruling by the referee. But Goilala had the advantage after handling errors by Koyari shifted the momentum to Goilala. And with some draw and pass, Goilala went over for an unconverted try, taking the lead four points to nil. Both teams had a few close calls but could not score any tries, leaving the scores at 4 0 into half time. The second half was fiery as the first, with both teams smashing into each other with no hesitation. Koyari made amends to their game and had Goilala on the back foot, finally going over for their first try. A successful conversion ensured Koyari took the lead 6 points to 4. It seemed all over for Goilala, but with just 10 minutes of play left in their season, a penalty conversion equalized the scores at 6 all, sending the match into overtime. The match came to an abrupt end in overtime when a tackle by a Koyari player on a Goilala opponent didn't sit well with the crowd. The crowd invading the pitch to attack the players from Koyari. It was later confirmed that a player from Koyari was stabbed by the crowd. The chairman of the league and management of both teams condemned the actions of the supporters. The CPPL board has decided to split the prize money of 20,000 kina with both teams declared winners. This is the third incident involving the Goilala crowd. Trilisukina National MTV Sports.